Hi guys, I know um, it's really windy and I hope you can hear me, but I'm slowly going to pan around and show you the uh, so-called boat party. It's about 5, 5.15 and it's multiplied in size and I'll quickly take you and show you the craziness out there. Here we are at Breeze's. We just had lunch. It's around three o'clock. And there's Dave. And I spent the morning in the spa. And I got my toes done. I had a pedicure. I know it's a little sandy. And I had a wonderful facial. And the tide's going out, but I want to take you into the shallows with me so maybe we can see some <laughs> schools of fish. Let's go. Did you see any schools of fish? Not those big ones. Not the big ones. Um, what's the name of this beach again? Long Beach. Okay, so this is Long Beach. There's some jet skis. They have jet ski tours. Yeah. It's like they're having fun out there. We saw the schools earlier when it was high tide. And it was amazing. It would look like a reef bottom or a grassy bottom and it was it would just move like a cloud and it was just these huge schools of fish so I'm gonna walk out a little bit more I think now that the tides going out they they might move out a little bit well I'm out above my waist and I haven't seen any fish any schools but this water is just so transparent. It is really beautiful, this color. I don't know if it shows up on camera, but I'm going to take you across Long Beach and show you Cambridge beaches by the water. Let me zoom in a little bit. There's the little eating pavilion where we've been, uh, had supper the past two nights and we had lunch right there in the little place on the left. 
right in there. And these are the different sides. Now, these cottages here on the hill are bigger. I think all the ones facing, as you can see, they look more like houses. But the thing about Cambridge beaches is it takes a while to get used to um, the quietness and how laid back it is. I mean, sometimes you go to the pool and it's almost empty. Or people, there are a lot of people just sit and read and it is so quiet. So there aren't any loud parties, that's for sure. So I think I'll head in, we'll dry off, and then um, we may go to the pool. And I have a funny story to tell you, but I'm gonna tell you later. It's my, uh, it's our anniversary actually right today, and I have a, the funniest story to tell you. I'll tell you when, when I get back to the room. Okay, I haven't videoed much today, but I wanna let you know that we are, I, we are at our, barbecue which is at the hotel and look at these colors look at that orange pink blue water glasses so anyway I have to tell you my ring story if you've been watching my previous video I lost my diamond out of my wedding ring in one of our connecting uh, one in, in one of the airports for our connecting flight in Charlotte um, I think it's North Carolina. And so I look down and this is what I see. I'm just gonna show you my ring. And, and this is what I see. Just these prongs sticking up in an empty hole, an empty black hole. So I was really bummed and I said to my husband, oh no, and he's like, oh, I guess we're gonna have to get you another ring sometime. So. I just put this in my wallet and like I said yesterday was our anniversary and I am sitting by the pool my husband finds the ring right next to the uh, carry-on bag which was open on the floor and he sees it sparkling on the floor and so he puts it in a baggie walks over to the beach and comes over to me and hands me this baggie and says happy anniversary and I look down and I'm thinking what is in there did you find a bug on the floor and I look down and there <laughs> I know it's little <laughs> but it's 35 years old to the day and uh, that is my diamond story so Hey, they say diamonds are forever. I guess this one definitely is. Instead of a prong setting, I'm gonna get like a bezel setting. So um, maybe it's a good thing that all this happened. So, <laughs> but I'm gonna head out to the pool and Dave's fishing for the day, bone fishing. Hope you're enjoying Bermuda and I will see you shortly. One of the cruise lines is leaving. I'm not sure if it's Carnival Cruise. I'm pretty sure it says Carnival on it. Yeah. This is really zoomed in, so sorry for the shaking. But. I think it says Carnival on it. Oh, they must be hating to leave, but they've got some fun ahead of them. And here we are, still enjoying. Maybe not, I don't know.
Thank you.